What is going on guys? Got another video for you. Today it's going to be about something a little different. Uh, no snakes today. None of that. Just wanted to introduce you guys to another one of our reptiles. Um, I don't know, you may or may not be aware that we have more than just snakes. I may have mentioned it a few times, but anyhow. This next guy is a leopard gecko. Uh, I believe he's a tangerine. I could be wrong. Um, he's very cool. This is Ridley. I don't know if it'll focus on him. But Ridley is a leopard gecko. And he is a very cool little dude. I don't know if you can see him or not. I'm sure you can see him. He's not very big yet. He's still a baby. I wish he would show you his face. He's always walking around smiling. Look at that. How awesome is that guy? Oh, I don't want him to fall. He's still a little clumsy. Oh, but he's a leopard gecko. He's very cool. That tail. <laughs> he's a very cool little fella. Again, I don't want him to fall. He's Trying to get crazy. He's acting crazy. Uh, oh, there he goes. He's not being calm. I was hoping he'd be chill for you guys. Again, his name is Ridley. He's my daughter's leopard gecko. Uh, not sure if you can make it out, but he's got a little spot on the back of his head that looks like a, somebody took white out and just drew a smile on the back of his head. Um, Anyhow, he's a very calm little dude normally. He's getting a little antsy right now, but he's really chill, really cool, really friendly. His eyes are amazing. Um, I thought he was going to fall. Anyhow, Ridley is one. We have one more leopard gecko, and I'll try to get him out to do a video on him, but he's still a little wild. Uh, He's not very chill yet. He's still kind of new to us. Not very new, but kind of new. Um, so we'll we'll do that. I wish he would just chill for a second so you could see him. But anyhow, maybe you can see him a little bit there. Whoop. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna put him back before I before he falls. But. That, look at them eyes. That's the coolest part. I don't know if it'll focus on the eyes. Uh, probably not. Anyhow, he's very chill. Um, sometimes when they get nervous, they make a squawking noise, which is kind of cool. Um, and this tail, the reason their tails look like this is because they store like protein and fat in them. Um, so he's healthy. He's, uh, he's in pretty pretty good shape. He's pretty healthy. Uh, the lady we got him from, uh, she's got some pretty good animals, so I trust that he's in good health. Uh, but anyhow, let me put him back really fast, and I'll be right back. Hold on one second. All right. He's up and back in his house. Um, so, yep, that's Ridley. He's a leopard gecko. Oh, sorry, I was trying to be kind of calm with a lower voice when I was handling him. This camera right. Uh, but anyhow, I'm sure, of course, you can hear the rats drinking. They normally don't make any noise until I turn the camera on. Um, then they make noise. But anyhow, um, that's Ridley, uh, the leopard gecko. We have some corn snakes to do still. And another leopard gecko, which, like I said, I don't know how he's going to act. He's kind of, he's a little uh, antsy, I guess. He's a little wild right now. He's similar to the baby uh, hognose. Uh, but he's he's getting there. He just takes handling. You just have to handle him a little more often. Um, so there's that. Uh, today is feeding day. I was going to do a feeding video, but I don't know how that will go over. Um, because most of ours still eat live. 
so I don't know how that would go over on YouTube, so we're not going to do that. Um, one of them does eat frozen thawed, so we may, uh, actually two of them eat frozen thawed, so we may uh, do that. This corn snake up here is extremely active today. He knows it's feeding day, or maybe he doesn't know, and I just feel like he knows it's feeding day. I'm not sure. Uh, but he never passes up a meal. It's uh, His name is Raymond. He's still small, which corn snakes don't get very big. Uh, but I feel like he should have gotten a lot bigger by now than what he is. And we've been feeding him pretty regular. Uh, so I don't know if he's got like a dwarf gene or something that's keeping him small. Uh, we did bump his feed size up to a mouse fuzzy. So uh, that may be why he's, he's starting to grow a little bigger. Um, I'm not sure we'll have to see how that goes uh, but anyhow um got off track this video is about Ridley uh Ridley is the I think he's a tangerine uh leopard gecko I could be wrong but I believe that that's accurate um I don't mean to uh misstate something say something that's not actual uh fact I, I believe that to be the truth um, I'm looking at the calendar over here. I'm sorry. So on Tuesday, I just did an update video. Um, Wednesday was Monroe, uh, our male hog nose. I don't know if you guys had a chance to watch it. Um, yesterday was Marilyn, which was the, uh, female baby, little tiny thing, uh, hog nose. And then yesterday was Negan. Negan is my boa. Um, we're still working with him over here, trying to get him right. Uh, he's getting better. We're trying, we're doing the best we can. Um, he's uh, he's still struggling, he's still struggle a little bit. Uh, I gotta figure out what's going on with him. I don't know. He, uh, I don't know. I'll get it figured out sooner or later. He might just be constipated, not hungry. I don't know, I don't know how that works. Um, I do see the the hog knows the male hog knows he's sticking his head up he uh he knows it must be feeding day um everybody's out and about on feeding day i don't see romeo out uh, but in a little time it's still kind of early i want to say it's not even seven o'clock here yet so uh in a little time he'll be out and about as well um the other leopard gecko uh his name is randall he is shedding right now, so I don't really like to mess with any animals when they're shedding. I like to let them finish their shed good before I mess with them. So after he sheds out, I'll try to do a video. Um, not exactly sure when that'll be, but whenever it is, I'll have that video up for you guys. Uh, we did have, um, yesterday we found 13 uh, pinky rats. So the rats are doing their thing. They're, uh, they're breeding on up or producing for us. Uh, so that's actually saved us some money uh, this week because I took four of the pinkies out and uh, we use them for feeders. Uh, one for the hog nose and then the two corn snakes. I believe a pinky rat is almost the same size as a fuzzy mouse. So it might just be just a touch bigger. I don't know, we'll have to see. Um, when it gets down to it. I'm looking at them over here in the, the container and they might be just a little bit bigger than a fuzzy mouse, but we'll see. We'll get worked out either way. Um, it is feeding day for everybody except for Marilyn, I believe. Let's see. Yeah, Marilyn, no, she can eat today. I don't have it on the calendar actually when she ate. Yes, I do. She ate last Friday, so I can feed her today um, as well. I'm trying to feed everybody on the same day. Um, my my pied kilo, he was kind of on a weird situation where he didn't want to eat for a couple days, so uh, fed him Sunday. I'll offer him again today. It hasn't really been a week, but I'll offer him anyway. Uh, I don't know if you can hear that noise. That's the. Um, the rats that are almost a month old, they're making a funny, like a cooing noise. They're still trying to feed on their mother, and I think she's trying to wean them. I think they should be weaned in maybe a week and a half, two weeks from now. Um, 
when that happens, we'll separate them out and uh, get them in tubs so they can. There's only three of them, so I have to figure male and female, and then um, separate them out accordingly. Um, let's see what else do I got. Uh, it's been raining here lately. I don't know where you guys live at uh, here in Mississippi. It's been raining every day for seems like the past week. Um, so it's been kind of sloppy outside, and I really want to get out and do a whole lot. Uh, also, in the city close to where I live at, they're implementing a face mask um, thing in all the stores. Here, we've kind of been open, uh, pretty much open, wide open, since I want to say last Monday, yeah, the 15th. Uh, everything opened back up completely. We've been at a slow pace opening up, but now everything is completely open. So they are doing a face mask. Uh, in stores so, and uh, they're talking about a fine thousand dollar fine I don't know if that's true or not I'm sure it is um, so I have to look into that and see if that's actually fact um, we did go to the pet store today to pick up some feeders because mine have yet to produce enough to be sustainable they're getting there though uh, so I think our feed bill went from fifty dollars a week down to twenty 20 something right at 30 bucks so that's good um, and we bought crickets for the leopard geckos they like to eat the live the little bitty the little baby quarter inch uh, crickets so they have a house full of crickets hopping around in there now uh, they're happy they're eating uh, let's see what else I guess that's it guys I guess that's all I got um, when I get ready to clean the uh, uh, leopard gecko house maybe i'll make a video out of that uh, that might be pretty interesting i'm not sure and i have to change out i have to change out link and zelda's bedding soon so i may do a video on changing their bedding uh they've got some flowers and stuff in there that i need to get out and you know, so i can get their bedding out and dump it out and make sure their their house is clean with um, I use rubbing alcohol and water uh, just to sterilize it and let it dry really good and then wipe it down one more time with just water make sure it's clean but anyhow um, that's all I got this time guys uh, again this video was about Ridley Ridley is a um, I think I believe for him to be a tangerine uh, leopard gecko I am not 100% positive on that if anybody watches this and you know leave it in the comments let me know what you believe he is. Uh, from what I've been told online, some of the people in some of the groups on Facebook can be kind of rude. Uh, but I asked online, or my daughter asked online what they thought he was, and they just pretty much said if the breeder didn't tell you that you'll never know. I don't know if there's truth to that. If there is truth to that, let me know about that as well. Um, let me know what you guys want to see next. I'm not 100%. I don't think I'm going to upload again until Tuesday of next week. So that will be the 30th of June. I'm not sure what that video is going to be. It could just be an update video. I may start doing every Tuesday just an update video. I'm not sure yet. Um, but that's all I got. Probably talked enough. Uh, I will see you guys on the next one. I appreciate it. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. Uh, let's grow this channel. Let's make it happen. I'm excited about it. I don't know if you guys are excited. Let me know what I'm doing wrong. Let me know what I'm doing right. If I need to change some things, let me know. Again, I'm using my camera. The picture actually looks a little clearer today. I think my phone was in my pocket all day yesterday and I was at work sweating. So might have been why I was a little foggy. <laughs> I apologize for that. Uh, anyhow, like I said, comment, share, like, subscribe. Uh, help me grow this channel. Let's get on up there. I'd like to get to a thousand. That's kind of the target I'm shooting at right now. After that, we'll see where it goes. Appreciate the view. See you next time.